In this lesson, we'll continue our review of Passport to Advanced Math Concepts. We're in the official PSAT practice test, section 3, no calculator, question 10. If f of x minus 1 equals 2x plus 3 for all values of x, what is the value of f of negative 3? You want to be careful here because we don't just have f of x here. We have f of x minus 1. And we want to find the value of f of negative 3. And so just think about what would this value of x be so that these functions are equal. This value would be negative 2 because then we have f of negative 2 minus 1 that's negative 3 and then we can find what the question is asking for. So really that's the key for this x here we're going to put in negative 2 because that will equal f of negative 3. So whenever we see an x we're going to put in negative 2. So that's just going to be 2 times negative 2. That's negative 4 plus 3. The answer is negative 1. And we've got one more advanced math concept. It's question number 11. Which of the following is equivalent to this equation? So here we've got a quantity s minus t times s over t. Really what we can do is just distribute the s over t. So we're just going to break each one of these down. So we've got s t and that's the same as just multiplying by s and then we have minus s t times t. Right? What I did is just split up that quantity and now what we can do is this term will multiply as s squared over t minus so here, the t's are going to cancel out, and we're just left with s, and that's the answer, c.